All right guys, this workout is gonna really work your biceps, your lats, your back, and your core. And we'll just go ahead and get started right here. Starting out with pull-ups, wide grip, many as you can do. Going for speed, explosive power. Feeling that mind-muscle connection. So really feeling your lats and your biceps. Wow, I'm doing more than I thought I could. All right, when you slow down, rest maximum 10 seconds. All right, do as many more as you can. Which apparently is three for me. Rest, we're gonna do two more sets of this. No more than 10 seconds, rest. Okay. Ah. Okay, and then one more set. Same thing. Really feel that burn. Yep. Okay. We'll transition straight into close grip pull ups. These work your biceps a lot more. Wide grip pull ups work your lats. So here we go. Alright. No more than 10 seconds rest. Really feeling your biceps and your lats contracting through the whole rep. Okay, if you get to where I'm at, where I can't even pull it up, so boost yourself up with a little jump, and then just let yourself do an eccentric, slow move, all the way down, really getting maximal fiber contraction. Oh, that sucks. All right, move straight into bicep curls. This is 65 pounds, see if I can do any at all. You don't want to do what I'm doing, which is arching my back. So don't do that. Many as you can do. Little small rest. Four or five seconds. Let's get two more. Again, don't do what I'm doing, which is arching my back. It'll lead to spine injuries. Alright, last part. Do some leg raises. This will be really good for working out your core. Twist. And hold. Center cold. Oh, it's really sucking. I'm done. And that's so you can do that on its own or add it to the end of a workout to really blast your back and your biceps and just get a real good burn in there.